Hello, Microsoft Office Excel has a very useful function to fill columns or rows automatically as the days of the week or the months of the year. For example, you want to fill the days of the week for 365 rows as from B10 to B375. First, you fill B10 with Monday. So B10, we put Monday. Then click and hold the mouse at plus icon. The plus icon is just the bottom right corner. When you see this icon, you click the mouse and drag the mouse to the bottom until 375. So now you have 365th row and just leave your mouse. Then you will find As we wrote Monday, so you have Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, automatically and repeat. If you want to use the abbreviation as sun, you write just as un, then go to the corner, see the plus icon, and you go down. Also, you can do January. Just so you write January, you go to the corner, see the icon and go down, wherever until you, the row that you want to. You will have January, February, March, auto field without repeating or typing. Obviously, it happens exactly with the abbreviations. But what happens if you want to use the days of the week in Spanish, in Chinese, in German, or in French, or even in Korean or Japanese? So if you want to Sunday in Spanish, as Domingo. So you go to the corner, you will see the same plus icon. You go down, drag. The problem is you will see only the copy of Domingo, 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 Domingo. If you want to use January, February in Spanish. In Spanish is Enero. You go to the corner, see the plus icon, go down. You will copy only enero, enero, enero. This problem will happen most of the computers because the Sunday or January, these tables that calls custom list is set up in Excel only in English, not in Spanish, not in Chinese, not in German, not in French, any other languages. So you have to set up the called custom list for the language that you want to use. So we go to File tab, click File tab, you see the menus, the last menu is options. You click options, Excel options window is opened. Here you will see the general formula data and everything you, you find the advanced. 
click advanced advanced starts with editing options cut copy and paste pen you go all the way down you can use the bar on the right side to get general this general menu is not the same as this general menu so here you will find the custom lists click edit custom lists opens custom lists in custom list you will find in english list of the days of the week and the months of the year you click the new lists here you have to put in spanish or any other language that you want to use one by one You put all the days of the week in Spanish and click add. Here you see the new custom lists in Spanish, the days of the week. And you click OK. Go again OK. Now you see these ones. You put Domingo. Plus icon, you drag down. Now you have the days of the week correctly in Spanish. As we added the days of the week in Spanish in custom list, the months in Spanish, obviously it will not work. So you have to add whatever language that you want to use for autofill. You have to go to the file tab, options menu, advanced, go all the way down, edit custom lists. It is really hard job if you want to write here all the days in different languages. So you don't need to do this. Just you go a table. If you need, you can copy this Excel file from easystudy101.com. You go to the language sheet here. So we cancel this one. I have prepared one sheet where you have English, Spanish, Korean, Chinese, German, Japanese, French, the days of the week. Obviously, here the days of the, the months of the year in different languages. If you have this table, it's really easy to add your language to the custom list. We will start with the file tab, options, advanced, edit custom lists now you have here the custom lists we will start with spanish months 
So I want to find where is the Spanish. Monsus is here. Now, instead of you write down here the, all the days or months of the week in a different language, you have import list from cells. So you want to import the months of the year from the cells. You click here. If you have any other cells pre-filled here, just you uh, delete that and start from zero. Click here and you go to see here in the Spanish month from January to December. In Spanish, the months or days they use lowercase. Here you verify again from C18, C29 is Spanish months. So you click import. Now you have here the Spanish months. So you click add. Now you want to use the list in Korean. Okay, you click new list. Delete the Korean months import and add in chinese okay i do new list again delete this one i go to the chinese chinese in japanese use the same months in chinese letter so i have to import this chinese months I click import. Don't forget to click add. Sometimes this is not added. If you don't click add, delete in German. Import, import, add. Now, yes, have January and okay. So now we click. Okay, and okay. We will see now it's working fine. Okay, just I have first months, uh, first day of the week in Chinese. I go to the corner, I go in German. The months of the German. In French, in Spanish months, just you have to find this plus icon and go wherever you want to go is filled automatically for the days of the week or days of the months. Now, you can use autofill function for any languages. Just you need to add to the custom list the language what you want. Thank you for watching. If the video was helpful, please like and subscribe. Have a good day.